Hi, Frank. Pass me a skillet. I am Mo Brennan McConnell, and I am something of a food geek. This is my buddy, Frank Brightson. He's a guy who needs no introduction. Frank is teaching me how to cook his amazing food here at Brightson's restaurant. We are gonna pass the skillet, that being a term that's used by the Cajuns to indicate the, the passing on of a food legacy. I have all my dry seasonings pre-measured. See that? Salt, pepper, herbs. I have uh, actually three kinds of pepper, black, white, and cayenne. Not that it's a hot and spicy dish, but each pepper tickles the palate in a different way. Really? Because I always Black wondered. Pepper, white pepper, cayenne. Get out of here. So you're creating a progression of sensation with each bite. I promised you I would show you how to keep broiled fish from sticking. I think you need a combination of fat. In this case, I'm using a little clarified butter. Or you could use olive oil. You need something like that, a little bit of fat. And then you need some liquid. In this case, my recipe just happened to make a little extra crab stock. And I'm covering the bottom of the pan with crab stock. And we're gonna add a little bit of our stock, just a half a cup, to moisten our dressing. Look at you. I'm gonna add just a half a cup of this stock. Can y'all see how he did that? And that'll stop the browning. He put that little strainer on top of the stock. See now, you, see that? you know what I would have done? I'd have picked up that hot pot, I'd have put it over something else, right. I'd have poured it. Just bump. See, when you got, Boop. you know, when you got like a... Kitchen hacks. One of my many rules in cooking is that you have to taste everything you cook. Indeed. I'll leave that to you. Can I lick the pot? Uh, yeah. <laughs> I think yeah. I've made about 30,000 of these. Really? This is the best one. <laughs> Delicious. Oh, man.